I know what you're thinking. I got this big toy hauler. Built these big ramps. This big new side-by-side -side goes on the back of it. But how am I going to tie that thing down so it doesn't just yeet off the back of it? After a fair bit of thinking and a bit of research, this is what I've come up with. This track system. It's called an e-track system from Grunt. Grunt.com. I think their website's usegrunt.com. Pretty much I'm going to use four sections of this track, one under each wheel. At the front up against the canopy, there's these little wheel chocks that clip in, so I don't just run into the canopy. And then to connect my big tie down straps over the top of the tires and pull it down, they've got these little strappy lanyard connector things. These snap into the track system, and then your tie downs clip onto there. So let's get this thing fitted and put the side by side up on top, grab it down, see what it looks like. Obviously there's lots and lots of holes in these tracks, I'm not going to use all of them, but just using these little high tensile bolts with a bigger size flat washer on the bottom just to spread the load out a little bit. Simple as that, buggy up on top. These drive straight up on top of these tracks. Bumps into the wheel chocks. I jagged that pretty well. I think one more notch forward and it probably would have hit that. So I'm to throw on some of these clips. Adjust some of these big heavy tie downs and strap it down. There, she's all strapped down tight, say the magic words. That ain't going anywhere. But the whole rig is going somewhere. We're just gonna take up a quick strap down the shop to get some lunch. Let it shake around a little bit and see what it looks like. And meet you back here.
happy with how these turned out. They look much easier to use than full-blown tie-down straps. Just clip these in and out when you drive the buggy on and off. Like I said at the start, you can check out their full range at usegrunt.com and you can special order them through Bunnings. That's where you buy them. If you want to see how they go long term, you're just going to have to subscribe, follow along and see if I end up doing a video of this thing on its side once it's fallen off the back of the trailer, but time will tell. Next video, the rooftop tent should be here, so we'll be throwing that on. Stick around for that. That's it. Time for a beer. See you next week. Yeah.